Hi, my name is Anne Guye, a marriage and family therapist partnering with Ponea Health. And today I'm talking about the dynamics of marriage. In the earlier, an earlier episode, we talked about how fam, uh, early childhood experiences affect relationship in marriage. And uh, now we are going to look at, and, and we talked about the intrapersonal and interpersonal relationship between the couple. But now we are going to talk about um, external factors that uh, add to the dynamics of marriage. Um, and here uh, we talk of maybe if we pick the fresh example of uh, how COVID happened and um, impacted lives. Um, and it was just a sudden happening and where people uh, started working from home and then even as you work from home, uh, there is changes in lifestyle. Um, in addition, there was job cuts and, and um, okay, uh, job loss and, and maybe even pay cuts and children uh, being at home throughout. So there's all these things that uh, marriages have experienced that, were, uh, that made life difficult. And then other external factors also come in um, where uh, gender roles are affected. Uh, if this couple that maybe because of COVID is now at home, and uh, so gender roles um, come in uh, into play. Uh, now if we go back to COVID scenario where people are working from home, and because usually the mother takes care of the young ones. So in the gender roles, if the man is the one who lost his job. What happens? Will the mother be expected to still do her roles as a mother, taking care, running after the child, and do their work online, and, and be a wife and all that? So here is again where communication style comes in. Communication is key. Communication, communication, communication. And so uh, the couple will talk around their expectations of each other. They will talk around the changes and how it is affecting them, their concerns. They, there was a lot of anxiety with this uh, pandemic, especially. And so uh, that is one of the ways external factors come in and add into the dynamics of marriage. Uh, there are other factors like um, relationships, uh, both came from families, as earlier uh, um, explained, where the interaction patterns were learned. And so how do they handle these relationships in marriage? Are there influences from um, family of origin or primary family for both uh, the couple? Uh, at times, there is a lot of influence, uh, which is uh, unhealthy. And I don't mean that uh, we disconnect completely with our family of origin, but balancing on how to allow them into our marriage. Uh, because again, there are times that they will come in handy, you know, when one needs self-soothing and that kind of interaction. But they, they shouldn't be the first go-to when things are not working. It, it is, needs to start with a dialogue between the couple and that the right way of starting those conversations. Thank you for uh, engaging with us. Um, you can reach me on ponea.com and we look forward to engaging with you in the next episode.